Hello and welcome to another Beast PC video. Today is an exciting day because we're testing by far the most expensive part we've had on the channel. An Intel Core i7-8700K, Intel's flagship beast from just a few years ago. Today, we're going to overclock it. The CPU features 6 cores and 12 threads and it's aging quite well, still comparable in performance to a modern Ryzen 3600 or maybe more since we're overclocking. Its 14 nanometer plus plus fabrication is very mature and these are generally good bins, so we'll try to hit 5.0 GHz today, which pretty much all the chips will do with enough voltage. The main question for us though is cooling. We haven't deleted it and the thermal interface material isn't known to be the best under that IHS. It has hyper threading as well, which is really bad for power consumption, and we don't have a super fancy cooler. Nonetheless, we'll try our best, and onto the test system. We're using a Gigabyte Z390 Aorus Master motherboard, which is also suitably top of the line for this CPU. It has a 12-phase VRM, postcode, 6-layer PCB, dual 8-pin power connectors of which we only need one. It's just an incredible board all around. To try to cool this hot CPU, we'll use a Noctua NHD15S, which is the best cooler we have, although I'm already assuming that it won't be enough. For RAM, we'll use 16 gigabytes of 3600C18 at XMP. It's not the absolute best, but performance should be adequate. For other things, under the motherboard's M.2 heatsink already is a 500 gigabyte NVMe drive. Then we've hooked everything up to a 850 watt power supply. We're using an RX 560 for a simple display output. As you might have noticed, we're throwing value out the window today. Money is not our primary concern. Let's get started and cue the montage. On with the overclock.
Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please leave a like and please consider subscribing. See you next time.